This chapter explains how to change settings related to the ventilator and screen displays. This video is not a substitute for proper training. Users of the NKV-330 ventilator should be properly trained and have read and understood the operator's manual. Specifications are subject to change by Nihon Koden at any time without notice. Some products may not be available in your country. Contact your Nihon Koden representative for details. Select the menu operation key on the main screen to display the menu window. The menu window displays the windows that can be opened with the ventilator. Windows can be checked easily since the buttons are laid out according to the content of each window. Select any key on the menu window to change to that window. CO2 and SpO2 in monitoring are only displayed when a sensor or probe is connected to the ventilator. Select the menu operation key to display the menu window. And select the patient info key to display the patient info window. Select the current patient type in patient type to display the patient selection window. Set type and new patient. and select Accept to admit the patient. Select Height to display the height window. Turn the operation knob to change the height. And press the operation knob to confirm the change. The height window closes. Select male or female for gender. Set the oxygen supply connected to the ventilator. Press the menu operation key to display the menu window and select O2 source in setup to display the O2 source window. Select the oxygen supply type from HPO or LPO. Select HPO when a high pressure oxygen source is connected and select LPO when a low pressure oxygen source such as an oxygen cylinder is connected. Select X to close the O2 source window. Set the pulse sync sound on or off and alarm sound volume. Select the menu operation key to display the menu window and select audio volume in setup to display the audio volume window. Select on or off for the pulse sync sound. If set to on, turn the operation knob Touch the slider and slide it up and down, or touch the increase or decrease button to set the volume of the pulse sync sound. Set the alarm sound volume. The setting method is the same as for the pulse sync sound volume. Set an appropriate volume for the environment where the ventilator is used. Select X to close the audio volume window.
set the content to be displayed in the cabinet area. The cabinet is an area at the bottom of the main screen that displays numbers and a review window. Setting cabinet display on or off. Select the menu operation key to display the menu window and select cabinet in setup to display the cabinet configuration window. Set cabinet to on or off. The selected item is displayed in light blue. Setting the cabinet type. The cabinet type can be set regardless of whether the cabinet display is turned on or off. Select the item to be displayed in the cabinet from the Detail Numeric settings. When Detail Numerics, which is set in the contents, is selected, the parameters to be displayed can be set. Select Detail Numerics in Contents to set the parameters to display. Select the parameter display position from the left and select the parameter from the list. If the parameter to be set is not in the list, select left or right arrows to change the list display. Repeat the same steps to set the remaining numeric display items and select X to close the parameter setting window. Select X to close the cabinet configuration window. Set the parameters and waveforms to display on the main screen. Select the menu operation key to display the menu window and select display in setup to display the display configuration window. To set the parameter display, select the number of parameters to display from 4 or 5 and select the display position of the parameter from 1 to 5. Select the ventilation parameters to display from the list. Select X to close the vent parameters window. Select the CO2 and SPO2 parameters to display. Select the waveforms to display. Select X to close the display window. Confirm the numerics. Press the menu operation key to display the menu window and select numerics in measurement to display the numerics window. The numeric window displays a table showing ventilation measurement parameters such as airway pressure, respiratory volume, respiratory rate, as well as the CO2 and SpO2 values. Only the currently measured parameters are displayed. Numerics are updated in one-second increments. When a upper and lower limit alarm occurs, the corresponding measurement value is highlighted. The colors in which the measurement values are highlighted and alarm messages are displayed can be set in the System Setup window. Select X to close the Numerics window. Set the screen brightness. Press the menu operation key to display the menu window and select brightness in screen to display the brightness window. Turn the operation knob or touch the increase or decrease button to set the brightness. Select X to close the brightness window.
lock the screen when transporting a patient or clearing the display so that the screen is not activated by accidentally touching the touchscreen or operation knob. Select Menu to display the menu window and select Screen Lock to display the screen lock window. Select Yes to lock the screen and operation knob or select No to cancel the screen lock and return to the main screen. The To Unlock the Screen Press the Power Key message appears when touching the touchscreen or operation knob while the screen is locked. Press the power switch on the ventilator to unlock the screen. The user help window shows how to connect the breathing circuit with easy to understand illustrations and explanations. Select user help on the menu window to display the user help window. After the ventilator is installed, use the System Setup window to change the ventilator settings and the Control Settings Master and Alarm Settings Master setting to suit the facility in which the ventilator is going to be used. In order to avoid any problems caused by users being able to easily change settings, the System Setup window requires the ventilator administrator to enter a password to display the administrator windows and change settings. For more details, refer to the Administrator's Guide of the NKV-330 Ventilator.